you saw the emotion of him holding up his grandmother's picture, saying, I made a promise to you. I made a promise to you. This is who I'm doing it for. He did it for the woman that raised him, his grandmother, with both of his parents out of the picture in Richland, or Richmond, rather, California, one of the roughest areas in California. Tack McKinley joins Deion Jones. All that speed that everybody had uh, on that defensive side, and now they get another weapon. For more on Tack McKinley and that story, DXL takes us down to Susie Culver, who's standing by with the newest, happiest member of the Atlanta Falcons. Well, Tack doesn't just have the photo of his grandmother, Myrtle Collins. He's got the tattoo right here on his arm. Tell everybody what she means to you, Tack. Speechless. She means everything to me. Like I said, I, I probably wouldn't be here without her. Like I said, of course, I had a lot of support from my family, friends, teammates, coaches. But just to come this far, like where I come from, born in Oakland, raised in Richmond, California, a lot of people don't make it this far. A lot of people got talent, but they don't get the opportunity that I had. So I did this for my grandma, I did this for my family, I did this for my city. And I mean, it's only the beginning, but I'm, I'm like Marshawn Lynch said, I'm thankful. <laughs> as a little thankful. kid, as a little kid, you were you were abandoned and you were homeless. What were the promises you made to your grandmother? So before she passed away, about two minutes before she passed away, I told her I was gonna get out of Richmond, I was gonna get out of Oakland, I was gonna go D1. And I was going to make it to the NFL. About 30 seconds later, she closed her eyes and passed away. And that promise, it, it meant everything to me. Like I said, being a non-qualified out of high school, going to community college, I mean, I could have easily gave up. I could have easily went the street route, the gangs, the guns, the drugs, the kids, et cetera, et cetera. But no, I stuck with it, man. And like I said, I, I did it for her. I did it for her. You've had some father figures in your life. And another one with the Atlanta Falcons, Jeff Ulbrich, he recruited you at UCLA, and now he's a linebacker's coach for the Falcons, and I know he stood on the table to try to get them to draft you. What are you looking forward to there? Uh, hey, it's simple. Get to the quarterback. It's that simple. Get to the quarterback. Heart, relentless, uh, get to the quarterback. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. Yeah, congratulations. Thank you made it, man. Thank you so much. Trey, back to you.